Uh, it's the start at 2 a.m. and then it kind of turns into a race actually, that's quite a key bit of information, it turns into a race. Um, yeah. <coughs> 2 a.m. Maybe a little bit stoned. <laughs> he was already there, wasn't he? <laughs> Musicians. <laughs> Devours North London streets at 2 a.m. Rubber razor wheels, aluminium feathers, head down, piston legs, he flies. Pete's 20, tatty trilby, whiskers, searching bright eyes. Mind of a scientist, body of an athlete, spirit of a Tottenham shaman. Head down, piston legs, he flies. October's iron mist strikes his hungry lungs as the road rises and twists under him. He turns a bend, he sees a fox. Fingers reach for brakes, foot drops to floor, he pulls up quietly and watches. The fox is 20 feet away, sniffing the night air. He catches Pete's scent, turns towards him. They both stare, still. Measuring. Lustrous, rust red, whiskers twitching, foxy cocks its slender head. Curious. And then saunters in Pete's direction. He stops. Sniffs. And then trots. Stops again. Ten feet away. Pete can hear his own heartbeat. Six feet, five, four, three, two, then the fox is at his feet, sniffing his socks. Mine! Pete jumps back. Foxy just looks amused. It's pretty psychedelic now, isn't it? I don't know if he was smoking something in that little bit of the journey. I'm sure now what to do. Pete just pedals off slowly. The fox follows. Pete smiles and pushes up a gear. The fox follows, throws him a glance that seems to say, What have you got, bicycle boy? <laughs> Pete digs a little deeper. The fox's amble switches to a run at his side. Mouth wide, tongue to the night air. All right, all right, okay, he says. There's a park a half a mile ahead. I race you, there. Colts mesh with oil chain. Fox's body lowers. Ears switch cleanly, foot and thigh. Ears back, tail straight behind. Blood surges, heads down. Piston the legs, they fly. They fly like the night has suddenly come alive. Heroes cheer by empty streets for crossing a divide. They fly. Pedals, tires, nails, paws hit a rhythm. Peter tries to edge forward, but the fox matches everything it's given. Lungs are white, heat, and feet screaming, come on! Teeth blur, feet blur, rock, neck and neck, push, come on! They fireball, cars park cars, fences, signs of bus stop and tired houses. This burn arouses streaming wild eyes, this burn arouses screaming wild cries. Pete shouts, fox barks, dead heat, the park looms left, suddenly end of the street and the fox darts towards it. Brakes, burns, he skids, turns, stops. Gasping for breath. Looks back at the fox. It looks back at him. And a thin, wispy thread of emerald light streams between them. For a heartbeat, neither knows himself from the other. They both shiver. Thread dissolves. He loves. The fox has turned and pads into the bushes. That's a true story.